Hey Alan, this is Josh. This is from Crown down here in Chattanooga. Just wanted to put a face with my name. I'm gonna do like a little YouTube walk around video of this Outback and post on YouTube and send it to you. So um, so you can see up front what I'm looking at too also. It's a lot easier than taking pictures on here. But here's the Outback right here. So this is just walking around it here right here. I'm gonna do kind of like a little close up of, you know, kind of the sort of headlights, you know, anything around that you might be interested in looking at. You know, here's the wheels right here to also just looking at it that way. Also, the tires are in pretty good condition too. Also, it's got plenty of tread left on them too also. And the Outback symbol, I'm looking around through here too also, and I'll get inside the vehicle here in just a second. But I'm gonna try to point out any dance dings or scratches or anything like that. So just so you see it up front too also. But here's the wheels on this one too also. So you can take a look at that. Also, the tire tread left on the back is pretty good too also, as you can see. But do a little bit of a walk around right here. And as you can see, it is an all-wheel drive Subaru too. Also, it's got the uh, parking sensors in the back too. Also, and of course a backup camera. So, as I'm looking through here, I really don't see any dents, stings, or scratches, and I'm not kidding either. Or I would just literally point that out. Maybe something small like this right here. I don't think you can even. Rough, yeah, that's just a little dirt patch. It looks like right there. So, um, but this thing is pretty clean. Obviously, we would get it cleaned up for you fully too. Also, but I'll let you take a look at this wheel too. Also, got that wheel right there. And also this one right here too. The tread is still pretty good on that one too also. Maybe a tiny little scratch right here. I'm not 100% sure. Yeah, it looks like it's t just a tiny little scratch that's right there. Um, I thought I'd just point that out to you right there. Also around, this is the side door right here. And this is this wheel right here. Also the tire tread left on that one is pretty good too also. All right, let me walk over here on this side right here. Now I'll show you, oh, hang on, let's see. I didn't even see this. Looks like it's a little bit of a chip right there, just to let you know. It's on the front right side of the passenger side of the hood too, so I thought I'd just let you know. Let's walk over here on this side. Oh, just to let you know, it's also got the full size. I'm sorry, it's just got the sunroof that's right there too also, so you let you know it has a sunroof. It's a limited, so it's got the leather interior inside here too also, and it is an all-wheel drive version. So you do have, you know, X mode if you want to take it off road and all that sort of stuff. Just anything you're in general set to doing. It's got Harmony Garden speakers down here too also, along with memory set seating and two keys that come with it. It also has got a power trunk lift gate, lane departure, adaptive cruise control, um, blind spot monitors, you name it. It's, on, it's pretty loaded out. <laughs> Go ahead and start this up for you. Tremendously larger than it would be outside the city limit. Sorry about that. I had to turn that down. It's got 51,472 miles on it. Um, obviously, you're getting pretty decent gas mileage with it, too. Also, um, 140 speedometer limit gauge on there. And as you can see, you have your adaptive cruise control on your steering wheel right here, along with your volume controls and your Siri control and all that sort of stuff. The bigger size screen that's in here, too, also, if I'm not mistaken, I think it has nav and stuff like that in it. Yeah, let's see. Yeah, it has navigation inside of it. I apologize about that. Um, but it does have navigation inside there. As you can see on the left and the right side, you have heated seats over here and you have dual climate control right here too also. Um, also a DVD player if you wanted to put some DVDs in there and listen to some music, you can still do that too also. Electronic park and brake right here too also. And of course your vents are right up there. And you need to control your sunroof, moonroof. You just put it through right there. It's right there. Go ahead and open it up for you. So this right here. I'm gonna go ahead and open it up for you. Go ahead and pop that open for you. As you can see, the sunroof works just fine. It's got a little bug catcher right there, so if you have people sitting in the back, it's not gonna have any issues with it. So I'm gonna go ahead and close that back up for you. And I'm gonna go ahead and close this back up. But as you can see, the leather interior's been taken really good care of. Um, too also uh there's no stains i don't see any stains or anything like that it's a pretty clean vehicle obviously that one little rock chip in the front but um let me know if you have any more questions or anything like that i'm gonna go over the more of the vehicle with you and if you'd ever like for me to send you more pictures i'd be more than glad to Alrighty, thank you and i will talk to you here soon